Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Deck Deck, and today we're playing some more Stranded Deep. Potentially the last episode. I thought we'd start on the title screen, because we need to have a look at Cartographer. So I made it back to base yesterday, as you'd expect. It wasn't that difficult. I came out of the game and, you know, had a look at this. We need to be heading... Like, northwest. I need to go between these two islands... I believe that's my farming island that I keep going to for trees. So I need to kind of stick on the left of that, past this big one, past that small one. Alright, let's get going then. Like I say, this is potentially going to be the last episode. And hopefully, I'm not going to rage quit the game again. Oh dear. Yesterday, when we killed the two bosses and I got the trophies. Oh, I've not shown you my trophy mantle. Let me go and show you where I've decided to put the trophies. Uh, I got the achievement on Steam for, in fact, if I bring my Steam overlay up, I'm sure I've got it set now so that you can see. Obviously, it's loading, so it's not going to like me doing that. Whoops, sorry about that game. Then again, it might not bring it up. <clears throat> it's just this achievement. I didn't think it'd be that difficult of an achievement for people to get. But the percentage of people that have got it is just crazy. Crazily small, that is. Yeah, as you can see my steam overlay. Um, yeah, collect all sea monster trophies. C call me Ahab. You can't actually see the percentage there, can you? Where is it? Oh, wait, no, you could see it there, couldn't you? I'm just being an idiot. No, you can't. It's like less than 1%. It's ridiculous. Anyway, enough of looking at my steam overlay. Keep away from it. Um, we need some food. <sighs> the only food I've got is the few rations that I managed to store. <clears throat> and I've already topped up with uh, fuel. I did that at the end, well, after yesterday's episode. And I've still got a tank and a bit of fuel left there. And let me chew on that. That makes me all nice and good. Is there anything else we want to do before we leave? There are my trophy mantles, so every time you come into the base, you get to see our achievements. I don't think there is anything else I want to do. I mean, I, yeah, I know I've not even finished the base, but I'm not being funny. All it is is me going and grabbing some clay. I could do it, I should do it, I shouldn't be lazy, but I'm being lazy. That and you, you know my actual feelings on this game. Good game. I've just been screwed over by it too many times. Right. Compass. We are wanting to go basically that way. Literally dead straight that way. So, bring up the anchor. I just want to try and turn it a little bit so we can get around the pier. Or the dock, or whatever you want to call it. Is that enough? Should be right. Yes, that is enough. So I've got one ration left. It's that island I want to stick to the left of, isn't it? No. I think I want to go to the right of that island. And then there should be a small island behind that one. And let's just check the compass to see what direction. Yeah, this is about the right direction we should be heading in. So let's just veer to the right of this island. Like I say, there should be a small island behind it. And then the, uh, the ship, I believe, behind that one. So... I've never actually finished this game, for obvious reasons. Yeah, it's just the barrels in the water. But you know what? Annoyingly, I come back and them barrels are still floating in the water. So where the hell has my raft gone? You know, what would be cool is if we got to this ship and it was there. And I don't mean this raft, I mean the original raft. You know, the one that yeeted out of existence. Uh, but yes, I've never actually finished this game, so I don't know what the ending is. This may be a very short episode. It depends. I, I, I don't know what to expect. I've never even watched anybody finish this game, so... I think this is one of the islands I flew over. That's not the ship in the background, is it? That's another island. Yeah, it's another island. There's a small island. I mean, if I get lost, I could always land... And, um, say, even go back out to the uh, cartographer. 
I mean, realistically, I don't understand why you can't make a map in this game. Get a piece of cloth, get some charcoal from the fire, start drawing a map out. You know, like Forest, as you um, as you explore, you uncover more of the map. I, I like the style of map in that game. Although, to actually use that map is a little bit... Mm, your place and position doesn't seem to line up with the map as well. But, I like the thought that went into it. You shouldn't just find a map like in Green Hell and it's got all of it. But then again... These places, you know, it gives them backstory. They've got history. People have been there before. They've charted out all the, uh, all the area. You know, I like, I like to discover it all for myself, really. I like to discover it all for myself. I completely forgot where that trail of thought was going, by the way. Absolutely forgot. I'm eager. Maybe I should be going more that way. It was past a small island. Just going to point the raft a little bit more this way. Yeah, because it did go more west later on, didn't it? I mean, it's probably just straight behind this island. I'm still holding shift as that makes me move quicker. I'm sure we'll see it at a distance. If I could see the boy uh, for the squid and then the, um, the dead whale for the shark yesterday, I'm fairly sure we'll see it. A collapsed boat somewhere. Now, should I go and save it before I go here? I'm fairly sure that's it. Just, you know, something something about it tells me that that's probably it. Also looks like it's on an island, so maybe I'm just going to be able to save it there. Anchor the raft. I know I won't forget. Promise. But yeah, as much as I've... Uh, criticised this game. It's got its good points. I've really... Uh, I have enjoyed it, apart from... I mean, I, I'd class them as bugs, what's happened to me. Admittedly. You never get told that your gyrocopter's gonna fall through a boy, or you never get told that if you don't anchor your raft, save it, and then die, that your raft's just gonna despawn. I, w I genuinely expected it to just be floating away like it was the first time round when I went onto the island, saved it, and ran back across, but... hey how It happened. Never mind. Move on with it. Now, I've not really killed many sharks. I'm, I'm not going to tempt fate and try and kill one now, like, but... Right, I'm literally just going to go straight into the land. We're going to drop that. Uh, we're going to take this out of our hands. Drop you. Drop you. And save. Alright. Um, I'm not going to take the spear gun. Somehow I don't think the spear gun's going to be what I need. Is that a goblin shark? That looked like a swordfish, actually. Might be completely wrong there. Uh, give me an axe, give me a knife, give me a refined pick. Should I take bandages and stuff? No. I'm going to bet on me not being an idiot and dying. Famous last words. Oh, I guess we're going up here, though. I've got to explore it. I don't want to miss anything. I'm quite the completionist at times. Don't count my base building as not being a completionist. Please tell me this isn't just going to be a straight path all the way through to where we need to go. Because this is going to be a very short finale if it is. Okay. It's very, very linear. It's very linear so far. I mean, you can't even check any of these. I guess if you come into this place, then... Oh. Have we finally got doors to go through and whatever? Oh no. Oh no we don't. This is this is the actual end. We're gonna have like a ten minute finale. Stock food, stock water, stock fuel. How much of each? <clears throat> How do you repair them? Oh you need a hammer. I need fuel. Food. Well, I've got some water. I've got one food. Maybe we won't finish this episode now then. There's a big island very close to us. I'm sure we could go and suss something out. Or failing that, I could probably just 
cook some fish. Okay, right, let me back down. Can the shark music please go away? You don't scare me. Right, so in actual fact, I don't need you, you, or you. Um, uh, ma, 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 ma. Might as well take all three water skins. Surely one tank of fuel is going to be enough. I'm actually going to be marginally annoyed if it needs more than that. Because then I'm just going to have to go all the way back to base to wait for potatoes to grow. Well, I've probably got some ready, actually. Uh, just to cook them. To go all the way there. Uh, to go all the way back. To come all the way here. Right. Food. Holy Christ. Did that take all three servings? That took all of them to... Well, I'm definitely going to need more gasoline then, aren't I? Okay. Um. What? How do I do this? Oh, no, don't drop the hammer. Go into here. Story, plane, aircraft engine. Is this how you do it? Right, I see, I see. Story, aircraft, repeller part. No! I'm not being funny. The hitbox for this is dead. Oh, I'm aiming there. It's not even at the propeller. Stupid. Stupid. Story and rudder part. Right, so I need some gas. I need a little bit more water. And I need a ridiculous amount of food, apparently. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to have to go back to my island because I need the uh, actual fuel. That's upsetting. I'd try and kill the shark, but no. I'd rather not. So if a ration only gives you that much food... Wow, I spun that way too much. If a ration only gives you that much food... I'm actually going to attempt to kill this. Oh my god, it's doing the sensitivity thing again. I don't know how many spears this will take, by the way. That one missed, didn't it? Four spears. And it was a goblin shark. You know what? I'm going to make a quick fire on here. Anchor your boat, you idiot. I just dived off it again, didn't I? Also, what is wrong with the spears? I never realised the sharks were that easy to kill. And that was a goblin shark, yeah. He still tries to talk underwater. What an idiot. <laughs> Yeah, stop with the leather now. I, I want, like, shark steaks. There we go. Need some oxygen. Yeah, food's definitely going to be the hardest thing for us to get. But if you give me a few steaks, hopefully we'll be fine. I see the water snake. Baby shark. No, not even. Is there any sticks on here? Oh, I dropped my axe off. I'm going to need kindling as well, aren't I, to make a small fire? Yeah, 
I need to get my raft back. Now, let, let's go back to the island. I still need fuel, so it doesn't matter where I cook this, really. <clears throat> and at least if I go back to... Is my raft sinking? At least if I go back to base, I can smoke it and make sure it's not going to spoil. I need to put it in one of these chests. Just go away. Don't need you. I wasted fuel getting here, damn it. Right, at least I know exactly where it is now. It's straight behind this island. Uh, probably going to be quicker to go around this side of it. Just trying to think. Well, you know if I'd have got all the food that I actually had on my raft originally. Um, I'd probably have been able to sort that. Them rations, though, they really didn't put a dint in it, did they? And there's no, like, meals I can cook or anything like that. It's literally just shark meat and stuff. Ooh. So that's not my island right there. That's the island I need to head for. My island will be behind that one. Right, two nice waypoints. We've got the Crescent Moon Island and the Cove Island, or whatever it is. So I need at least a full tank of um, gas. I need, like, one more water skin's worth of water. And a million food. We'll be able to get a million food in 15 more minutes. Find out next step. No, that's not how it works. <clears throat> we should be able to. I'm just going to go on a fish killing spree. Or actually, it might be better to just take the raft out a little bit further. Go on a shark killing spree. You know, get revenge for it ruining my series almost. That'd be a nice time to have a gyrocopter. That's not my island there, is it? It will be, yeah, because I was on the left side of that, weren't I? You'll know if it's my island or not, because there's a mast sticking out of the water. As we get closer, but I'm sure that's my building there. And that one lone tree. How do I get lost so easily on this game? No, no, it is mine. It is my island. I'm waiting for the shark music to come on. Quiet. Hmm. Hmm. This word spread. Do they know of my um, my victory over the goblin shark and the megalodon? Just like, well, if you can kill those two, then we've got no hope. There was there is normally a shark around my island. Used about half a tank to get there, so I'm going to have to use the four that I've already got. Uh, I'm on about the gas, gasoline. I'm going to have to use the four that I've already got to top this off a little bit more. And yes, I'm just going to slam straight into the dock. Yesterday, when I was doing this, it scooted for a lot further than that. Um, uh, ma 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 ma. And just get that over half. Uh, I guess we can go drop the rawhide off. Uh, 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 uh. There you go. Uh, right, let's get the potatoes and stuff being cooked first. Have I got none that's grown up? Nope, fair dues. I don't know where that alloc... Oh, the plants grow back eventually. Well, I didn't know that. Because I've not replanted them. Absolutely haven't replanted them. This will give me a tank in a bit, I think. Oops. Might as well put four in there. 
And you're going to need some sticks each. I've got absolutely none in there. Amusingly, the only axe that I now have is on my raft because I lost all of them. It was right there, genius. Um, can we put the hammer away as well? Because I clearly didn't need the hammer. Well, I might have needed the hammer. This is why I never got rid of the logs. I just chop them if I need them. Although I hope I'm not hitting my stairs right now. Pick the meat up, for God's sake, man. Okay. That's them loaded up. Didn't I already load you up? Kinda. Yeah, well, let me just waste them. I guess that's good. And the rest of the sticks can go in there. Let's get these cooking. And luckily for me, it's actually going to become night time soon. Which is good. Because I can just go to sleep and then all this stuff can get done overnight. Uh, let's go and grab the meat. Uh, give me the spears. I don't think it takes the value away from it if you smoke it rather than actually cooking it, but... Uh, I need the kindling. I should fill the water up now before I forget that one. Two, three, and one, two, three. Right, whoops, did not mean to do that. Let's go and see if we can find anything. Is it a grouper? The big fat fish boys? Watch a shark come out there. Oh, it's getting dark so I can't see. I mean, I could cook a load of sardine, but let's be honest, that's not going to fill much, is it? Isn't it normally around this shipwreck? Hammerhead shark. Okay, then. He came out of nowhere. I'm getting the raft. I'm not playing you silly games. Just going to push the raft out here a bit and then I can hunt you properly. I've got to be careful. There's those stupid purple things around here. The stingy starfish thingies. Come on. Back it up. literally just want to go forward a touch. I shouldn't be using fuel. I'm not going to be able to see it now, am I? For God's sake. I just don't know how much food's going to be enough food. And yeah, I'm aware that I'm leaving the raft out there. It'll be fine. I'm just going to go sleep. I'm not going to be able to hunt much in this uh, light. Again, I don't know where the purple things are. But I know they are around this way. Oh, did not mean to do that. Let's go sleep. If in doubt, go sleep. And hopefully it's going to come to the nice bright morning, not the horrible, stupid, dark morning. Nope, it's the horrible, stupid, dark morning. Brilliant. Which is like halfway through night still. Quarter past four. Uh, smoked large fish. Lovely. And you've actually finished. Yours. So I've got a can and a half of that. I've got some smoked large fish meat. I still want more meat. I genuinely don't think three large fish meat is going to cut it.
Shall I Google it quickly? Because I don't want to go all the way back there and be sure. One minute. Apologies for this, but really. How much meat do you need for the end? End game items. How much food and water servings? Uh, two jerry cans full of two full clay masks. Ten food. I use medium, but I believe it, believe its size doesn't matter. It is, it's just 10 food. Well, I mean, they only count as one serving. So, I guess I'm gonna just go grab a load of salmon. Really? That seems a little excessive. There is a purple jellyfish around here somewhere. I'm probably gonna walk on it. And all my antidotes are on the boat. Um, right. Give me this. <clears throat> So we've got three already. I need seven more. Uh, do we think I can do nighttime fishing? Oh! Yes, I saw it. Last second. That's what the noise was for. Two. Three. Four. Just stick your face in the water, mate. I can't see. Uh, where's all the sardines at? Five. Come here. Oh, that's a Nemo. Is that seven? That's seven. Right, let's go get them cooked. <clears throat> oh, now where's the purple thing? If I swim along my dock, I should be fine. Kind of. And we're going to have to deal with him standing there going, gross, yeah, gross, lovely. I guess it's probably about as annoying as me moaning about it all the time. Anyway. I, I believe what I read. Hopefully it's all going to be right. Wait for it. I didn't... I was just about to say, oh, he didn't say it. The only problem I've got now is I've actually got to wait for this all to cook. Which shouldn't take a massive amount of time like, but... Eh, we're actually going to have a full-length finale, because I've got to get back there, yeah. Last one. You'd have thought they'd have made it a bit like uh, raft style. Two, three, four, five, six, and... The trick that Raven told me about. The last one on top of the fire. Two should be enough. Uh, yeah, raft style, where the bigger fish, meat and stuff, gives you more servings. Obviously, you get the small little fish that are all one bite, and then you get the, like, the, the salmons and stuff like that, that are like three bites, and the shark meats that are three bites. Never mind, though. And really, I shouldn't be comparing games. They're very similar, but very different as well. I guess I might as well tend to my crops while I'm here. But if you're wondering what the Woover Lava Lula, whatever it is, is for, it was for the shark repellent. I just never got around to making any of it. Yeah, we'll just wait for that all to cook. Um, potatoes. Hello. Hello, hello. Uh, there's the thingy one. A juga. Can go in there. Got my water, got my fuel, waiting on my food, then we're good to go. Cook, my precious. Cook. You know what? No, I'll get a screenshot of the plane while I'm there. That'll be the final screenshot. Oh. So, who thought I was going to make it to the end of this game? And who thought I was actually going to quit it again? I'm in that I actually thought I was going to quit it again category, if I'm being honest, after the other day. Raven also thought I was going to quit again, but she's also the one that talked me into not quitting. I know I mentioned it before, so 
you've all got Raven to thank for the end of, well, for me ending this series, although that was worded terribly as well, for making it to the end of this series. That's the words I'm going for. Yes. And uh, like her, although she's not on at the moment for reasons. Hey, ding. Um, if you want to watch me play these episodes, as I, uh, if you want to watch me play these episodes, how can I keep saying it wrong? If you want to watch me record these episodes live, then come join me on my Discord. I stream live to my Discord while I'm recording. Not all the time, but often enough. Right now, I'm not streaming. It's uh, it's kind of early for me. Nobody's on, honestly. But yeah, just think, you could be one of the people that's on, and then I'd come and stream, because I'd see your name there. That, and you can point out any silly mistakes I'm making as I'm making them, and who doesn't like pointing out when people are making mistakes? It's one of my favourite pastimes. In fact, one minute... I'm just putting the meat in the chests because I'm fairly sure it doesn't spoil if it's in the chests. Fairly sure. It's like your potatoes and stuff. They'll never disintegrate if they're in your chests. But if you leave them in the farm too long or in the potatoes... Uh, the fuel still. The potato still. Yes, it still is potato. Well, technically it does still. Anyway. Um, yeah, if it's in a chest, it doesn't despawn. I think. Don't hold me to that one. But I'm fairly sure that's how it works. Alright, this is the final trip. And like any anime scene, it's raining. That means that it's sad times and somebody's just passed away. As far as I know, nobody can pass away. I'm the only person in this world. But anyway. Anyway. And we want to swing a left around this. I'm not going to bother saving when we get to the island this time. I'm just going to go for it. Just going to sprint upstairs, load up our supplies, and go. So many islands that I've not checked out. I mean, I imagine they're good, but... Can you imagine if I went to all 25 islands? I wanted to hold the left. I need to find water. You don't, my dude. You don't. I need my compass. I'm going way too far north. I need to be going that way more. And this is why I should have got my compass. Wasn't I meant to hang to the left of that island as well? I'm fairly sure I was. That's the island we're heading for. It's behind there. I had two islands to use as a waypoint, and I chose not to use either of them. Stupid. Stupid person. But yeah, so many islands. Some designed better than others, but still, I imagine the amount of time that went into making those was just absurd. So uh, props to anybody's island that I've been to, and also, I guess, props to anybody's island that I've downloaded and not been to. Apologies. But... I think we've been to enough islands, and it's like one of these islands, generally, I could have built most things. Well, what was it? The It wasn't the first island I went to, it was the second one where I got all the barrels and the tyres and stuff for my original raft. It is good that you can get that many uh, resources from one island. And I guess for people like Cage 848 and Game Edge where they build huge structures... Islands like that are even better because they actually put the farming time in and stuff like that. Once I've got a base that holds everything I need, I'm generally content. And the base that I built wasn't the biggest. I didn't even finish the upstairs. I could have at least turned it into like a decking area or something, couldn't I? <laughs> it, it, I've, I've put effort into certain games like The Infected. I tried so long to make that a huge base, but... When you're farming trees for like three to four hours between episodes, and this applies to this game as well, when you're farming for hours in between episodes just to make a bigger base that's got no functional purpose, no, I don't like it. The game that I think I end up making the biggest base in is probably Seven Days to Die, and this is a little bit of a sore topic because me and Raven have 
just lost our map that we've spent the last few weeks building. Which I won't go into why, but... Seven days to die, bigger bases are better. Because you get the zombie hordes coming at you at night, it gives you more shit. Well, the more base you've got, the more places you've got to hide and the more places you've got to defend. I normally end up making like a, a serpent's maze on the inside. So even if they break in, they've still got walls and doors to get through and stuff like that. The base Raven had designed was a gigantic square, and then outside it had like a one step moat into it, and there was just like a million spikes all around it. But the plan was later on to have turrets all around the top of it, and I, I'm trying to demonstrate with the mouse. Is, is it going very well? Don't forget your food, you idiot, while you're rambling on about games that you're not currently playing. Uh, but yeah, get certain games I just don't see the point for making monstrously big bases. And this is just kind of one of those. I guess that's my point about all of this. I'm trying to think of any other game where I've built a huge base. The forest, I went massively overboard with the base, in my opinion. It doesn't compare to the, stay, uh, the scale of other people's bases, but I'd got all my functional purpose out of it, really. Who came to shut the door? That's creepier, more than anything. Right, water is done. That really does only count as one. That is kind of crap, if I'm being honest. Hey, one for me. Ooh, let's not die of water. Let's not die of water. Yes, I just said that. Yes, I just, just took a screenshot. And what? Oh, he says things other than, um... Ugh. Are you sure you want to leave? Well, let's save it, just in case I come back to do anything else. Yes. You should wait for better weather. <laughs> oh, I can't even leave the game how I want to. The rain should pass soon. Is there anything on this deck? I'm not being funny, dude. You have got a very short space to take off in. Surely that's not enough room for a plane to get going. Or is he going to, like, go this way and then? Or is this one of them slingshot things that gets you up to speed quicker? Maybe that becomes a ramp. Can you tell that I've never been on a plane before? I've definitely never been on a seaplane. Anything in there? No? There could have at least been some excitement and adventure on this, um... This ship. Go home, ball. You too good for your home? You too good for your ball home? Come on, rain. Cure bomb. Now that I've actually stopped and staring at this rain, it looks like blades of grass are being... Well, blue blades of grass are being thrown at me. Rather weird, actually. Although it's sunny... It's just a light shower. Can we take off in this uh, condition? Damn it! Go away, blue bla blue blast, blue blades of grass. Try saying that three times quick when you're drunk. More impressively, how's it raining in here? Come on! It's sunny. There we go. We're leaving. Look at that sun just coming straight in there. Right, let's see. How are we going to take off in this short amount of space? Rubber turkey. I'm impressed that the dude knows how to pilot a plane. I mean, yeah, people have got different life experiences and stuff. Have I got to do things? Oh, all right then. I thought it was just going to be like, you know, a court scene, being as I said I wanted to leave. Didn't realise it required audience participation. Okay. Cockpit is closed. Good. Take hold of the... No? What's he doing? 
The engine rail. Right, that's the thing that's underneath me, right? Yes, it's going to catapult me, isn't it? Well, not catapult, but you know what I mean. Throttle. On your marks. Mm, get set. Feels like a ride at Alton Towers. Oh, you get your propeller up to speed while you're here, and then it's going to be to launch. Yep, it's, it reminds me of Rita at Alton Towers. I don't know if I actually had to steer that then or not. I started pressing up to try and go up. Holy Christ. Can you imagine if you failed the ending of the game? Well, I say that. It reminds me of Dying Light. I failed the ending of that game several times. We're free! We're free! So, how do you know which way to go, dude? Is my question. Really? Hmm. Well. I guess. That's kind of it. Well, how did we end up getting to 41 minutes? Well, that really took its time towards the end, didn't it? Three hours later. Okay, right. We've not done yet. Sorry. My bad game. My bad. I'll have a drink and shut up. I just got magnets and out of the front. Oh, you can see it at the bottom right. Escaped. Question mark. We're going to crash, aren't we? It's barely letting me look anyway. It wants me to look this way. And the cycle continues. And the cycle continues. Can you imagine? You'd been through all the trauma that I've been through without the several cases of death that happened. You're just leaving and some imbecile like you the first time round flies straight into you. Oh. you just hope for death at that point, surely. I wouldn't want to go through all of that twice. No. No way. But yeah, that is going to be it for a Stranded Deep series. I already know what I want to play next. Hopefully you're going to enjoy that. It's a bit of a survival game, which... Yeah, it'll, it'll replace this quite well. I've got no um, no experience with the next game either. So, uh, you know, I'll put, I'll put half an hour into it or so. Get a little bit of practice before I go um, recording with it, hopefully. It'll all work out okay. But thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the series, feel free to leave a like. If you've made it to the real finale of the series, then well done to you. I probably would have stopped what... Well, actually, I don't know. Rage Quit V2.0, uh, episode 13, I, I did watch back myself and laughed at. So that probably kept you coming back once you'd seen me Rage Quit once, twice. Wanted to see if I'd do it again. Well, I didn't. Haha. -ha. But yes, if you've enjoyed the series, feel free to leave a like. Uh, all comments and feedback have been greatly appreciated. Thank you very much for your tips that you've been giving me. They've helped a lot. And special shout out to Raven for doing the fact searching like she always does for me. And if you'd like to see more content from me, feel free to subscribe and you can get notifications whenever I upload a video, which is two times a day. I nearly said three times a day. Used to do three times. Only do two times at the minute. Yeah. I'm also on Twitch as well, which you can see on the outro screen and in the description below. And my Discord is also on the outro screen and in the description below. So until the next series, thank you guys and see you guys next time. Cheers.